Okay. So Chantel, um, I already put this thing in, this one and this one. Bio silk because I have very dry hair. Um, what you do is it's easier for you if you split your hair in half. So just split it in half and have it both ways like this. So your finished product goes in the back. So you work, okay, so let's just work with this hair first, this side. So you work from back to front and that's how you get that like really nice curl in the back so you're not reaching. And then, so what you do is you just section some hair here like this. And since I have very thick hair, I have to do it like by little. And so, yeah, this is awkward. And then you just go and curl. And yeah, usually if, um, what is it called? Like you need it for like a long period of time, your hair. Um, Heather said like you just clip it, like you have multiple clips or something so that you keep the curls in. And then what you do is you hairspray it after you're done curling each strand or each hair or each section I mean so that it doesn't um you know so it lasts longer but yeah you just curl it like this so what what I usually do is I curl away from my face because since um I don't really need that much volume it actually helps curling away from your hair helps to like um what is it called frame your face so it's usually see like that and then you just put the finished product behind and then you keep going and this is awkward sometimes i comb and comb it down so that there's like no unevenness so make sure that you, when you curl your hair it's i guess smooth and even
Okay, so I am done with my hair. And then what I like to do is use my fingers and kind of just like loosen the curls a little because I don't like tight curls. It's kind of like make it romantic. So just loosen it a little bit here. To get like separate strands like this, so that there's more, and then in the back too, like that, and then do the same. But make sure that when you curl your hair, when you curl your hair at the beginning, make it super super tight so that you don't lose curl over time too. And then, yeah, that's it. That's all I got for you, shall tell. Yeah, so just kind of like loosen it up a little and then gather, you know. With your bangs, I don't know if you have bangs, but it's better if you kind of take it. My friend Dwan um, Danica, Nika, showed me this. Like when she did my hair for graduation, she like told me to tuck it in like this. But use like a paper clip. I, I'm not a paper clip. Um, hairpin. I don't have one right now. I don't have one with me right now. But you tuck it in so that it's kind of like stays in place. Yeah. And then, uh, like I said, it's better if you like hairspray each strand when you are curling it so that it stays better and longer and then of course like I said make it tight so that yeah and then what I do is I split it on the middle again like that and hairspray it but kind of like I don't know don't over spray your hair because you still want that nice, loose, not artificial look, kind of. Uh, there you have it! Yay! Heather should be proud of me. I can curl my own horror. <laughs> Peace out. Love you.